What's up, man? It's your man, Cash. Get a big smoke, man. I'm trying to hurry up and get y'all my thoughts on J. Prince Sr. and his little threatening words to Offset and how I feel about it, man. Because people keep getting my inbox asking me to do a video about it. So I guess I will. So this is what it is. For one, I feel like J. Prince senior is out of line he out of line for even speaking on that man and his family relationship no matter what they was going through they still family so matter if he wasn't there physically with his cousin when he died he's that's still his blood that's still his family so jay prince don't have nothing he, he shouldn't even spoke on that he too goddamn old to be still talking about some goddamn uh he, he too old to not know that his family go through shit. That family go through shit. And you know what I'm saying? No matter what, they always going to be family. No matter what, bro. So he shouldn't be saying nothing or shouldn't have nothing to say about nothing because they 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 wasn't feeling each other at the time. But shut the fuck up. Then turn around. Turn around. Offset saying he ain't even, he ain't even making no, I think you just want, because he ain't talking to you. You just want to start some beef and just want to be, just want to put something out there to see where he at. Somebody, you got ears everywhere. Bro, you don't got ears nowhere. You don't go nowhere. You stay the nigga state in Houston. You don't go nowhere. Motherfuckers don't even move around. So how you talking about you got ears everywhere? Ain't nobody reporting back to you. You just making shit up. But like I said, I feel like he out of line. And then for him to say, don't put him in a situation to have to defend himself. Man, nobody scared. Man, motherfuckers ain't nigga. That was back back in your ghetto boy days when them motherfuckers probably was scared of you. These young niggas nowadays don't give a fuck about your old reputation, bro. Nobody give a fuck about no shit like that. Don't nobody care about nobody reputation no more. Cause everybody will do something. Anybody, anybody niggas do air. These young niggas out here dropping shit. The legends. So you think somebody care about you or what you? What you I got to put me in a. Damn, man, shut the fuck up. And then just think about this. Whack 100 say everything he want to say. And don't nobody never say nothing to him. Well, don't nobody never say nothing to him. Why? And you don't even, and, and, and Offset probably ain't even saying nothing. And you just trying to start something with dog. But when somebody else want the, want the juice, you don't even want to get him. You don't want to get him. You don't want to fuck with Whack with the juice. Because you know, you know, these motherfuckers don't give a fuck about your reputation. See, it's a difference when you know somebody that don't give a fuck about you or your old ass reputation. Or your weak ass son either. His soft ass, you could tell he's soft and just want to be hard. You could tell he's soft. Y'all niggas don't move around enough to try to bully people. Come up out of Houston. Go, go to, if you that about it, if you talking about you got ears and shit everywhere and, and people everywhere, go, go to Atlanta. Go to Atlanta. Go go there and, and, and let's see how that shit turn out for you. Go to Atlanta. Tough ass niggas. Go to Atlanta. Do all that tough ass shit. Y'all had that motherfucking interview, that uh, million dollars worth of game in Houston. Why y'all ain't go where they was at to have a million dollars worth of game? You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't move around enough to be trying to be that tough, bro. You know what I'm saying, man? Y'all, man... And this is my thoughts. I don't give a fuck about nobody. You know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck who you is or what you is or what you got, what what you doing. Fuck you. You know what I'm saying? That That's them people family. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's them people love ones. Like, how you going to speak on that? And then y'all, like, brush it off like a man ain't get shot a couple times and in the back of the head. Come on, bro. Y'all niggas is wildin', bro. Them niggas supposed to be protect. Y'all ain't even protect. Y'all ain't even can't protect people in your own time. Can't even protect people in your own time. So how's y'all niggas is, is, is like that, though? Y'all not even like that. I don't think you like that. Think y'all just a bunch of niggas that everybody, the, 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 the motherfucker just like, oh, that's that's my time. Oh, no, that's, that's rap a lot. Man, fuck out of here, bro. Nobody cares about that, bro. I feel like Offset, I feel like Offset did the right thing, bro. Speak up for yourself, bro. Don't let them niggas, don't let them motherfucking, 
motherfuckers talking about don't make me defend defend yourself then nigga defend yourself you feel like a nigga doing something do something make something shake something pussy old ass still trying to be a gangster hair gone in the front talking see now don't know what's going on you looking around your son looking crazy then you gonna say but it's all love ain't no motherfucking love nigga ain't you smiling all that man you don't even worry about it offset that nigga gonna die of natural causes in a minute anyway but hey man look man it's your man cat to get a big smoke man if y'all got something else you want me to speak on man just inbox me man you know i'm on it man go Follow me on Instagram, bro. Hit the subscribe button. Thumbs up. Don't cost nothing to do none of that. But my Instagram, man, is, you know, Cash get You're going you gonna to see me. Cash get a big smoke. Y'all going to see me. Glasses on, hoodie on. Y'all going to know my face. Go subscribe to me. Hit y'all boys in another time.